Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today is something different, something interesting. Here in my local town of Bryan, Ohio, there's this place called Murray's Cool Cars, LLC. I actually have a picture, a couple videos, and I'm going to do an interview with this guy. But he sells different unique vehicles. Many of them I have thought were strange, but I mean, as you see, Versus everyday vehicles, but let's go inside. Hello, See everybody. Welcome back to the channel again. As I made it in the intro video, I'm here with Murray at Murray's Cool Cars here in Bryan, Ohio. Tell me a little bit about yourself and how you got started. I'll be 60 next month, and I kind of fell into this by accident and uh, selling hearses and classic cars for three years, but in actuality, I've been doing it all my life but just decided to uh, go legit. I used to be a minister, then I was a real estate auctioneer for a while. And when COVID hit, it was time to do something different. I moved here to Ohio with my wife, uh, who was also a minister. She took a church. And so it was time to uh, do something and found this car lot here and it was for rent. So I, I rented it and started filling it up with cars. So how did you get into with the hearses? Obviously, I know you had unique cars out there, but every now and again, either I drive by or I'll see it on Marketplace that you have a lot of hearses for sale. How did you come about that? Um, it was kind of by accident. The first thing I ever bought was a flower car. And it, it kind of took off from there. I, I discovered that there was a, a real market for, uh, for vehicles uh, like this, professional vehicles. And so I started looking for hearses. I've had them shipped in from California to Florida to Washington to New York. Uh, they're not in my backyard, that's for sure. So. <laughs> kind of seemed that way at first, but you did tell me that you had a car from the Buddhist, a Buddhist first, was yes. it? Yes. Mm -hmm. I have a Buddhist hearse, uh, <laughs> right hand drive, came from Japan. Uh, a guy in Georgia had purchased it to make movies. Uh, he's a movie prop guy, and it the movie did not come to fruition, so it was for sale. And I thought I, I'd better buy it. Um, I noticed you have other vehicles out there, like normal everyday traffic vehicles. Do you just get them on trade ins? Do you just see them and buy them, or I see them and buy them. Yeah. So it's almost like a dealership, almost like, you know, you kind of like go to auctions, car auctions, and if they're good, decent shape, you can buy them for the lot and make profit off of it. I don't buy from auctions. Big question, way too many question marks. Um, I just heard my police interceptor start yep. up there. I'll get a video of that when that's out but, of there. Uh, yeah, I, if it's a good deal, you know, and, and I like it, sure, I'll buy it. I see that you also had a Plymouth Fury out there. Could that be the Christine that it everybody Chris, questions? It is a Christine car. I think the original Christine was a 58. I'm That's pretty sure it was. 1960, but they look... Just about the same? Very much uh, the same. It's a two-door hardtop. Uh, it is the, uh, the high back window. It's 225, slant six, three on the tree. Um, so it, it's a pretty cool car. It's just uh, sitting there waiting till I get around to it. I see you also have a Rolls, a Rolls Royce out there too. Uh, that is a 71 Country Squire. Uh, made the, the, the front end was swapped out, the fenders, the hood, um, to, to look like a Rolls Royce. The entire uh, interior was changed out. So, yeah. Did you say, cause so I it's all Ford underneath. So it is a Ford station wagon just made to look like a Rolls Royce. That's correct, yes. Ah, okay. So I myself was tricked. I thought it was a Rolls Royce. I'm like, well, the only thing missing is the hood prop. But I know they ripped that off. As you say, I know on some Rolls Royces they have it to where you can pull on the hood prop and you let go of it and it'll and pop go, down. And it'll pop down. That was not this one. Somebody just took it. They wanted a, a hood ornament off of something that I thought was a legit Rolls yes. Royce. Yes. Um, anything else you'd like to tell people out there? Or? You know, I, I, I'd like to think I'm pretty easy to deal with. I'm, I'm not some, you know, hardcore, uh, you know, shove it down your throat. I'm kind of easy going, and if you like the car, you're going to buy it. If you don't, well, have a nice day.
right. I mean, that's kind of how you usually would do stuff like that. I mean, the way I look at it, if I'm coming to a, any place like a dealership or for Murray, I want to come in. I want to be treated with respect. I don't want things crammed down my throat. Well, this is what you can get, and this is what we got. It's okay. Well, I'm willing to work with you if you're willing to work with me. Polite to me, I'm going to be polite to you. And especially if you're polite to me and I get something from you or if I don't do business with you, I'm going to put your name out there. Yeah. To get you more customers because that's what people should do. Small towns should be more respectful. Yeah, I know. It's not some big Ford dealership. No Dodge dealership. He ain't going to have brand spanking new cars. He's going to have something unique. Right. Like you said in the name, it's Murray's Cool Cars. How often do you get to drive by a car lot and say, oh, well, there's a Buddha searched or there's a station wagon that's made to look like a Rolls Royce. But are you got anything else you'd like to add to it or? Come on down to Murray School Cars anytime, drive through, take a look at all the cars. Do you know the address here? Because, well, oh, I mean, you obviously do. 105 South Union Street. 105 South Union Street in Bryan, Ohio. It'll be Murray School Cars. You obviously cannot miss it. So with that being said, I appreciate you for letting me interview you. Absolutely. Really appreciate it, so. Just Hurst. Yeah, you heard me right, Buddhist. Could this be the Christine? Plymouth Fury.
freshly detailed police interceptor for Crown Vic. Here at Murray's Cool Cars. Definitely need to come check this place out.